What a qubit is is a bit that's made out of a quantum computer, and the laws of quantum mechanics can say that it can be both a zero and a one at the same time. So you have the zero and one state, and、uh, you can think about taking a single qubit, zero and one state, running it through some simple algorithm. And then at the end, you get the answer for the zero state, and you get the answer for the one state, and you did all that in parallel, because it's not statistical. So now, if you have if you have that stacked on stacked on stacked on stacked, you can run in, you can run count countless uh, um, calculations at at the same time. By the time you get up to fifty three qubits, which is what we did in Google. That's ten to the sixteen states in parallel.、And、by the time you get to you know hundreds, that's a number bigger than there are atoms in the universe. Okay. But it sounds to me like brute force encryption busting is child's play, from what you just described. And people are now building quantum computers where I can I can kind of see in the not so distant future that you may be able to break what's called RSA, just as you said.